Let's hold this position. Damn it, Meatpad. All this senseless killing. For freaking what? Believe it or not, Breadstick, old chum, the war started because some dude got killed. Wait, what? One dude led to millions of deaths? Yup, maybe I'm oversimplifying it a bit, though. Let's talk! More flashback! Okay. So literally every single ruler wanted to hold on to their empire so badly, they viewed everyone else's expansion with deep paranoia. Britain, Russia, and France were sort of BFFs, and on the other side, Germany, Austria, Hungary, and Italy will also be FFs. Heard the phone! Italy? But those guys are on our side now. They change sides later. But don't get ahead of yourself. Pardon. Okay. So these guys have some informal alliance. But these guys have a defensive alliance, which means they'll all get into a fight if somebody messes with one of them. Guys, what the hell are you doing? We're in the middle of a battle! We're doing the war's origin story. Oh, interesting. Voila, monsieur. So everyone is paranoid and power hungry and have alliances and stuff. But you said this all started because one guy got killed. Meet Archduke Franz Ferdinand. Where? Shh. He's starting a flashback. Oh. Franz Ferdinand was Archduke of Austria. Pretty chill, dude. Listen, Uncle Joe. I mean, Emperor Joseph. There's some Serbian nationalism going on down in one of our provinces. So, I'm gonna go flex my military a bit. Have fun. Oh, and keep an eye out. There's a Serbian ultranational secret organization called the Black Hand, who may try to kill you. Ah, uh, okay. Bah! I'm sure to be fine! The Black Hand got to Franz Ferdinand and his wife. They were both murdered by gunshot. And that's when the war really started. They killed his wife too? Nerd. Yes, pretty barbaric. You got a wife, Breadstick? We oui, and two daughters. It's the smallest one I haven't met yet, because of the war. But that's why I'll do everything in my power to survive! <laughs> Or you son of a bitch! Like this! And this! Oh man, this looks bad. I blame my character development. <coughs> we have to find a medic! Forget it! You'll die if both of you try to carry me. I'm gonna go look for help. You take care of him. Finish it. Finish the story. I need to know what I'm bleeding to death for. You sure? It gets rather silly from here on out. Like, if I were you, I'd much rather die not knowing all this crazy sh Finish the story! So at first, people didn't really seem to care that Franz Ferdinand was killed. Like, sure, it sucked, but at least there wasn't chaos or anything but then. Serbia! Yo! What the heck, man? You killed my nephew! Aw, oh, crap. I guess some people in my government were plotting against you. Look! I know you're angry. I'm going to have to investigate this. Um, okay. Inside your country! Ah. Uh, with my own forces! Okay, but, you know, I, I don't know. Then I'll get my expansion. I mean my revenge! And that was not the end of it. Germany! What, what are you doing, doing here? Just out for a stroll. Germany! Serbia killed my nephew! It's a bit more complicated than- Do not worry. Little schnitzel brain. We will back you up if anyone, like Serbia, tries to mess with you. Oh, thanks, bestie. Okay, Serbia. Get your ass ready for invasion! Russia? What, what are, are you, you doing, doing here? here? <laughs> Just out for a stroll. Russia, these assholes want to invade me. But only because he killed, uh, your nephew. My nephew! Oh, guys, can we not? I really like Serbia. So if you attack him, I'll have to mobilize my army to look fancy and project power at you. But if you attack Austria-Hungary, then I'll have to attack you. Which means... Wait, I didn't say attack. France! What are you doing here? Oui, uh, oui. Just out for a stroll. France! Germany is going to attack me because they think I'm going to attack him. 
because they're going to invade him because his nephew, the Archduke, got murdered. Whoa, what a mess. Yeah, you have no idea. Whoa, what the hell? Hey, relax. I came back to finish the job, but then I started hearing your story. And, yeah, this war is dumb. I'm sorry I shot you. Ugh, we are at war. Does these things happen? Can I hear the rest of the story? Sure. What the hell? Take a seat. Okay, uh, where were we? Oh, right. Something, 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 something. You invade him, I invade you, yada, yada, yada. What? Hey, guys, what's going on? Ouch! Did you just preempt to strike me into Belgium? Well, I couldn't wait for you to attack me. It was a logical move. Uh, true that. Wait! But if you attacked Belgium... What are you doing here? Yes, the joke's getting old. The little birdie told me you guys attacked my boy Belgium. Well, turns out... Let me guess, you have an alliance with them. Yep. Well, I've decided to remain a neutral for now. So yeah, that's more or less how the war started. I think he passed away while you were talking. I don't know how much he heard. Oh. Maybe it's for the best. It's not a happy story, honestly. How was it in your country? You know, when the war started. Everyone cheered. We all thought we were doing our great patriotic duty to defend our allies. That the war would be quick, because we had right and might on our side. Same in London. Whole country cheered us on as we rode off to play toys, soldiers to kill ourselves because of a bunch of power-hungry rulers who manipulate us ordinary people into fighting for them. Hopefully future generations don't let their countries be the only one telling them the history, so they're not manipulated into making the same mistakes we made. Cheers to that.